For a guy like yourself that know your pencil as a starter and whatnot, how difficult is for the guys that, you know, not sure, going into this fourth preseason game, kind of know but don't know, and they still got to go hard in the paint? I tell my guys in D-line room all the time, man, put some good, good stuff on the tape because it's 31 other teams watching you. If the Miami Dolphins don't keep you, you know, you get picked up by somebody else. So always the biggest thing, my thing is effort to the ball. Put some on tape, stand out on tape. And, uh, you know, you'll be, I mean, I mean, if you don't stay here, I mean, you'll get picked up somewhere else. Obviously, you know, a guy that always had a smile on his face. I'll probably not smile today at King mm -hmm. just to see him let go. I mean, that's got to be tough for you guys. It's, it's very tough, you know, came in, you know, we got the news, texted in a group message, but at the end of the day, you know, it's a, it's a business, you know, that's my friend, you know, we built the bond here last year, came in with Chris Kasser, we built the bond, me, him, Vincent, each and everybody, so, you know, we built the bond, uh, and, uh, I mean, like, at the end of the day, you know, it's a business, you know, at the end of the day, you know, somebody's going to get released, every day somebody's going to get released, you know, it's going to be a time for me to get released, whether I'm getting too old, whether, you know, they don't need me no more, it's just a business of it, and I always tell people, you can't put your feelings into business, so at the end of the day, you know, it was very emotional for me, you know, because I built the bond with them uh, last year coming on, but, you know, at the end of the day, it's a business. How closely as a teammate do you pay attention to those last kind of roster battle spots that go on this week with so many people fighting just for that, that one last spot? It's very important because I feel like, you know, they release a D tackle here, you know, got to find who, who they bring in with us, you know, see if they bond with us, see if they gel with us, because like B-Flow said, you know, the biggest thing to, to do is trust someone, you know. And like, like another day like here, you know, a, a hot day out there, you know, where we grinding, you know, you got to build trust with that. I got to build trust with Kristen, knowing that when, when Coach call a certain call, he's going to be there. Kristen got to build trust in me. When, certain, when Coach call a certain call, that I'm going to be there for him, you know, playing on side him. So at the end of the day, it's all about building that trust. So, so each guy they bring in, you want to you be, be, be able to trust him. So who's the cat in the locker room with the old soul? There's some of these songs you guys are playing, you guys want to twinkle in your daddy's eyes and you guys are here jamming. Well, no doubt me. You know, I think, I think Cam Wick can tell you the same thing if you ask him. You know, when he was around, you know, can't wait. I always love him in the locker room when I, when I get the phone. I play the playlist. You know, I used to bump the R. Kelly, but I can't bump the R. Kelly no more, you know. But uh, I bumped, you know, Frankie, Frankie and uh, Frankie and Mays, you know, all of uh Mr. Biggs. I was bumping Mr. Biggs yesterday, Contagious, you know. So, I mean, at the end of the day, you know, I'm an old soul. You know, I think I get it from my mom, you know, walking around the house, you know, playing old, old school music. So, I mean, I love it.